cock-sucking little pieces of shit. Why don't you fucking get out from behind your goddamn computer screen, find me, and fuck me up if you're such badasses. Come on, do it. You got your little lynch mob, your little fucking corky form fucking lynch mob, where you're going to sit there and trash talking all day fucking long. Ridicule me, shame me, hide behind the fucking computer screen. You know, that's slave mentality. Slave mentality is basically, instead of actually confronting the person that you don't like and, you know, having a, a fucking fight, you you hide and think, oh, how can I fuck them over without consequence to me? Ugh. You goddamn motherfuckers. It's just, it, it's fucking ridiculous. I mean, I, I know, I know, like, a uh, Christian fucking fairy tale. He's a fucking truck driver. I know he's in California. Why doesn't he fucking contact Why doesn't he ever fucking contact me? Hey, Corky, I'm in town. Let's, let's, you know, meet up. He won't do it. He's a chicken shit. But of course, he's got a little bit more balls than the rest of you. Fucking slobby nugget, whitey little theater. Fucking shits. I, I don't, I don't, I don't want to hear... Oh, but we don't live in California. Some of us live overseas. I don't want to fucking hear it. You stupid fucking little cocksuckers. You hide your little anonymous shit and you want people to fucking think that you have some kind of validity. You're nothing but a bunch of goddamn degenerates. All you do is trash talk me. All you fucking do is trash talk me. And that fucking Tim, that fucking fuck... I'd sit there and I'd say to Tim, you know, these people are a fucking, uh, you know, irritant. All he could do was say, oh, you need to be nicer to them. You need to be nicer to them. No, no, I didn't need to be fucking nicer to them. I don't need to be nicer to them. What I need to do is I need to track every goddamn one of them down and beat the shit out of them on fucking camera. Even if I just do it to one of them, it's a message to the rest of them. Oh, he's threatening. He's threatening. Uh, uh. All you can sit there and say is a death threat. <coughs> Let's say it's a death threat. Ooh, poor babies. See, this is another uh, slave mentality on their part. They're going to do everything they can to destroy my ability to make money, to have any kind of income or credibility. Oh, it's not our fault that people don't want to be around you. Uh, would you go and tell people that I'm a schizophrenic, an alcoholic, a racist, a misogynist, uh, a liar, a felon? Uh, would you sit there and trash talk somebody to somebody else? It's a goddamn guarantee that that other person's not going to want to have, have anything to do with the person. Most people are not going to sit there and say, Well, I've heard this person's a horrible piece of shit, but I'm going to go interact with them so I can be sure. Nobody's going to fucking do that. That's not how human psychology works. You little fuckers know what you're doing. You goddamn know what you're doing. And then you sit there and you try to feign morality. You try to feign that you're the good guys. You cucks. You fucking shits. You degenerate bags of shit. You fucking failed abortions. <laughs> yeah, failed abortions. That exactly, that's exactly what you fucking are. That's exactly what you are, fucking salami nugget, white tittles, theater, all my mirrors, all you fucks. Oh! I wish I could go back in time. I wish I could go fucking back in time, right? To the fucking day or night when your fucking uh, father's about to fucking ejaculate his, his shitty sperm into your mother, and I could grab the motherfucker and yank him back, force him to pull out. So that instead of, you know, 30 years or so having little salami nugget running around on the computer, no, instead, it's just a glob of semen to be wiped up with a Kleenex and flushed down the fucking toilet where it belongs. I mean, seriously, I'm all for eugenics at this point. Because I see a whole lot of fucks who should have fucking been aborted, who should have never been born. And every goddamn one of them is on the Corky Forum. That's for damn sure. 
<sighs> that that's all the quirky forum is. It's 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 a little it's a little place where all the aborted, you know, people who should have been aborted, hang out. Fucking failed abortions. That's all you are. Fucking failed abortions. <laughs> I I just uh. You know I remember one time you know. Timmy, I was having a conversation with him. He was like, what would you, and this was like really, it was like, um, but one of the shit between me and Happy Cabby was really heating up with his trash talk. And it was like, he was like, you know, come up with, come up with the, the most horrible thing you could do to Happy Cabby. And I was like, the most horrible thing. And I fucking told him. And then he'd sit there and bring it up and be like, You're a bad person because that's what you want to do with your enemies. Look at what my enemies are doing to me. Shit. I didn't do a goddamn thing, for example, to Tom Fowler. Didn't do a goddamn thing to him. And he fucking stuck his nose in my business. Because he was fucking jealous. Rather than actually having a conversation with me, he decided to play private detective. And then I got fucking Tim trying to act like he's... Oh, my... That... I, I swear, if I ever see that motherfucker again, I'm going to fucking put him on camera and I'm going to fucking... In, I hope it's in public because I'll sit there and I'll, I'll be like, you motherfucking con artist, you fucking scam artist, here's what you fucking did. You know, you people got no problem with dropping my docs and contacting people and doing everything you can to ruin my reputation and ruin people's vision of me and perception of me to make me look like an absolute utter piece of shit. Despite the, never mind the fact that I already have so many goddamn uh, obstacles to overcome to begin with. But then I get people like you in my life. I'm just supposed to go, oh well, it's their choice. Oh. That's not what the average person does. The average person, they get somebody interfering with their life, they fucking put them down. And that's what needs to fucking happen with you goddamn motherfuckers on the car cube forum. Every goddamn fucking one of you. But I know, you're going to sit there and laugh and comment and laugh. How? Oh, because you know, you're safe. You're safe because I don't know where you live. I don't know where any of you fuckers live. You're, you're nice and safe. I don't know what you look like. I don't know what you do for a living. I know nothing about you. Um, but yet, for some fucking reason, for some fucking reason... You people are able to convince the fucking internet that I'm a piece of shit. You know? I make a comedy video. You say it's real and that's how I really think. I make a serious video and you go, It's boring. It's boring. It's boring. I interject my beliefs and you say that I'm proselytizing. Other people putting their beliefs on fucking video... They're getting millions of views. Millions of subscribers. So when I do it, it's bad and wrong and evil and it doesn't work and it's a failure. Other people do the exact same fucking thing and they're skyrocketing to success. Why is that? You know, I've, I've honest to God, I've never understood the rejection. I've never understood the fucking hatred. I've always used reason, logic, and evidence every goddamn time. Reason, logic, evidence. But it seems that the only thing you motherfuckers understand is a fucking lead pipe to the skull. That's all you, that, that's, that's just, that's all you fucking understand. Is violence and hatred and pain because you're a bunch of goddamn low IQ degenerates. Bunch of fucking low IQ de degenerates. Fucking goddamn cocksuckers. Oh, and you're gonna sit there and. Oh, cookies, chicken! <laughs> you stupid motherfuckers. You know, it's, it's, it's funny, because I get people like Christian Fairytale. Uh, I, he, he was on, I remember a Von Hilton 
hangout or something. He was trash talking me, calling me every name in the book, basically treating him like shit. And then I commented, I suggested that he's fucking his dog. Oh, he fucking cried and whined like a bitch. Oh, you're so mean saying that about my dog. <laughs> but no problem calling me every goddamn name in the book and ridiculing me. No problem at all. Fucking god damn it. In every fucking video that I make, these people want to fucking post on their fucking quirky forum and fucking criticize it, run it down, and they want to frame the fucking narrative. They frame the fucking narrative. You know, it's it, 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 it's bizarre because they're, they're like a negative PR firm. It, it's like I'm sitting there saying to a fucking PR company, the quirky forum, saying, hey, here's my new video. Make me look as dumb and fucking ridiculous and, and just fucking degenerate as possible. Make me look like a fucking crazy person. And they fucking do it. But then they're like, well, not responsible, so I hope. <laughs> no, you are. Because when you tell somebody that I'm a fucking horrible human being, they believe it. And then they respond accordingly. Oh, I know who Kiki is. He's crazy. He's crazy. And I walk up to him. Hi, my name is Nicholas. And their response is, You're crazy, Kiki. Get away from me. I don't want anything to do with you. I mean... You need beat up, YT Lulz Theater. You fucking, you need beat up. You fucking need beat up. I've been nice. I've used reason and logic and evidence. I've tried persuasion. I've tried fucking everything. You need the shit knocked out of you. Because at some point, at some fucking point, enough is enough. I mean, you, you got your little fucking internet lynch mob, motherfuckers. Do it in public. Do it in real life. Because I'm, I'm done with you fucking degenerates. Every goddamn one of you. Salami Nugget, you're another one who needs your fucking ass kicked. All my mirrors, you're another one who needs your fucking ass kicked. Christian Fairy Tale, I will kick your fucking ass. I don't care how many fucking uh, military training videos you've ever watched in your fucking life. I'll shove your goddamn shit fucking head up your ass so fucking fast it'll make your goddamn leg spin off. You fucking bitch. I'm done fucking playing for you fucking puppy people. You fuckers need beat up. And if you want to call this a death threat you oh, he's fuck you. You, do, you have done so much to me repeatedly over time and that that violate YouTube terms of service that violate fucking hu human civility and you no consequences for your actions I say one mean thing about you and you're like <laughs> and YouTube is like oh you monster you monster ban the video demonetize it <laughs> The minute I say anything negative about somebody, I get punished. But yet everybody else gets to sit there and trash talk me like fucking, like perfectly okay to do so. And when I complain, I'm told to fucking shut up. I'm told, so what? I'm told not to worry about it. But the minute that I fucking do it to you people, everybody wants to gather together and fucking put me down like a fucking dog. Every goddamn one of you on the quirky forum needs your fucking head kicked in, and I'll goddamn say it as many times as I need to. Stupid fucks. You don't, deserve my, you don't deserve my respect. You don't deserve my kindness. You deserve nothing from me. You deserve to be destroyed. You deserve to be ended, you miserable, degenerate, failed abortions. And if somebody doesn't like what I'm saying, tough fucking shit, because I've put up with the shit too long. You want to come to my fucking... Come, come to fucking Pasadena. I will beat your ass in a fucking parking lot. Or a back alley. Does not matter. 
And afterwards, I'll have a little bit of respect for you. As of now, you fucking pieces of shit. You goddamn motherfucking cucks. I hope to God, I hope to, f I mean, if there was justice in this world, every goddamn motherfucking one of you would fucking die a violent death. So yeah, that's how I feel. Fucking assholes. Piss off.